Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. How do you see the match going, Stuart? Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And the lineup for the home side. Well, the wide midfield players and the fullbacks need to have a good understanding here. If the midfield players tuck in, then the fullbacks need to get forward into the space they vacate, just to give them some attacking width. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, they're playing in a 4 5 1 formation, which is set up to counter attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. And the game begins. Had been extremely sloppy in possession. Al Soma. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Has a go. Oh, he saved it well. He's having quite the game for himself. Save after save after save. Now, brilliant work to keep that one in play. Just not looking confident in possession. Strong but fair tackle. Oh, good vision. Terrific block. And reading it absolutely superbly. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Wonderful chance, and there it is, 1-0, the efforts have been rewarded, and look at the celebrations. Just look at this again, the combination play in the top third of the field was so precise, but you do have to ask questions of the keeper, could he have done better here? I think so, you can't be beaten at your near post like that. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Kabin. Osman. A 
they've given him too much space. Has eyes for goal. And the keeper getting across to stop it. Played over, and a bit short with the clearance. It looked as though it had a chance of going in for the equaliser. It was close, it was a decent effort, just need to keep plugging away now, and surely the goal will come. Attack looks promising. Takes the shot. Body in the way. Now an opportunity from the corner to get right back into this one. They take it short. Can he convert? And he's gone and scored to level it again. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. So back underway following the equaliser. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Chances on, and it's in! The back and front, stunning scenes here! Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. Al-Soma. Omar Harbin with it. This is looking threatening. Must score! And fine goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box. Goalkeeper's ball, it was always going to be that way. He's enjoying space. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Not to be too blunt about it, Stuart, but this has been a struggle for him up front. Yeah, I've been really disappointed with him today, Derek. He just hasn't looked himself, but I think it's fair to say he hasn't had great service, has he?
So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Cabin. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. Really vital interception here. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Well, the away side haven't bossed the possession, as you can see. But what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter-attack. And a bit more defending on their minds here, I think. And intercepts again. Cabin. Now we're into the final half hour. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. They're making high pressing work for them here. Well, a badly timed run, just a fraction offside. So a personnel change then. Determined defending. A fine use of the ball. I'm putting it wide from there. A pity, really. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. And he stopped them in their tracks. Who can he pick out? Well, a long-range effort, but no real difficulties for the goalkeeper. Well, as we approach full-time, we have to say, playing away from home hasn't been a problem. Oh, he's in behind them here, Derek. Full credit, wonderful stop. So a throw-in here. So making the substitution now. How about the cross? Might be a chance here. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. Delivering it. Well cleared away. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? Lovely ball over the top. Oh, 
keeper dealt with it. Well, this late corner could represent their last chance to equalise. And there's the delivery. Well, nothing. This could be the equaliser. But no, when your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. Now sending it in. And a struggle to get it away properly. Well, they can bring it out now. And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today. But overall, they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.